Flames complete the sweep against the North Alabama Lions here at home. Brett McGibbon here alongside Paul Wetmore. And coach, it uh, seems like the Flames right now peaking at the right time of the season. For sure, that was a big weekend right here. Nice sweep, had a balance of everything. Had great pitching, good hitting, timely hitting, but uh, nailed the door shut here on that game. Great job. Let's take a look back at it now. And then the previous two games, the Flames bats were rolling. Today, a little bit quieter. Let's head right to the sixth inning. Danae Griffin throwing down the bunt. Kara Canetto, some great base running, managing to get back to third. The bases would be loaded. Mass and by a clutch hit through the 5-6 hole, would cash in two runs, and the Flames would lead three to nothing. We head to the top of the seventh. Georgia land a tough out all weekend with a runner on, would drive this to the gap. Runners would be at second and third. Threatening would be the Lions. Johnson would be taken out of the game, coming in Carly Keeney, and she would answer with back-to-back -back strikeouts, looking dominant, facing two batters, and that would give the Flames the victory. Absolutely, she was exactly what you wanted. Close that game out, two strikeouts like that, put that win in the books. Shouldn't go on, said Johnson, a great day. 6.1 innings pitch, three hits against, no earned runs. Revels on the other side of things was great as well for UNA. And Masson Vi once again continuing to do great work low in the batting order, driving in a pair of runs. Flames back at this coming Wednesday at Virginia Tech. We'll see you then.